pain is temporary. It may last for a minute, or an hour, or a day, or even a year. But eventually, it will subside. And something else will take its place. If I quit, however, it will last forever. Y'all spoiled. Y'all spoiled. Some of y'all spoiled. Just bottom line. Your parents have done everything for you. You never had to do nothing for yourself. You're spoiled. We're going to keep it real tonight. Some of you are spoiled brats. Every time you ever got in trouble, somebody in your house got you out of it. Every time you've done something you're not supposed to do, people say, Eric, your mother's a tyrant. You're right. She kicked me out. You're right. She's mean, but she developed a man because she put me out there and said, you're going to have to grow up. And some of you have never learned to grow up. And so every time something get hard, you quit, you call mama. I dare you to take a little pain. I dare you. I dare you not to go home. Somebody said, I got to go home, I feel bad. Go, go through it. You ain't going to die. At the end of pain is success. You're not going to die because you feel a little pain. I'm not eating like I eat at home. That's why you're about to go to the next level. Because if you keep eating like you ate at home, you will keep being a boy or a girl. It's time to become man, woman. Here's what I want you to repeat out to me, please, with power and conviction. Say, it's possible. That's all I want you to do when you look at your dream. Just say to yourself every day, it's possible. Just say that every day to yourself, it's possible. Because what does that do? See, it begins to change your belief system. I look at the world. See, the way in which we operate, ladies and gentlemen, it's a manifestation of what we believe, what's possible for us. Whatever you've done up to this point, all that it really is, is a duplication, it's a reproduction of what you believe subconsciously that you deserve and what's possible for your life. Most people operate out of their personal history, out of their memory. Things they've done, things they've experienced, things they've seen, things that they have observed. What I'm suggesting that you operate out of a larger vision of yourself. I want you to see yourself doing what you want to do, experiencing what you want to experience. Having what you want to have, doing what it is that gives your life some meaning and value. But I'm exactly where I want to be because I realized I gotta commit my very being to this thing. I gotta, I gotta breathe it, I gotta eat it, I gotta sleep it. And until you get there, you'll never be successful in life. But once you get there, I guarantee you, the world is yours. So work hard and you can have whatever it is you want.